While walking down the street one day, a corrupt sender tragically hit by a car and dies. His soul arrives in heaven and is met by St. Peter at the entrance. Welcome to heaven, says St. Peter. Before you settle in, it seems there's a problem. We seldom see a high official around these parts, you see, so we're not sure what to do with you. No problem, says the senator. Just let me in. Well, I'd like to, but I have orders from higher ups. What we'll do is have you spend one day in hell and one day in heaven. Then you can choose where to spend eternity. Really? I've made up my mind. I want to be in heaven, says the senator. I'm sorry, says St. Peter, but we have our rules. And with that, St. Peter escorts him to the elevator and he goes down, down, down to hell. The doors open, he finds himself in the middle of a green golf course. In the distance is a clubhouse and standing in front are all his friends and other politicians who had worked with him. Everyone seems very happy and dressed in their finest clothes. They run to greet him, shake his hand, and reminisce about the good times they had while getting rich at the expense of others. They play a friendly game of golf and then dine on lobster, caviar, and the finest champagne. Also present is the devil, who really is a very friendly guy, who's having a good time dancing and telling jokes. They are all having such a good time that before the senator realizes it, it is time to go. Everyone gives him a hearty farewell and waves while the elevator rises. The elevator goes up, up, and the door opens in heaven where St. Peter is waiting for him. Now it's time to visit heaven. 24 hours pass with the senator joining a group of content souls moving from cloud to cloud, playing harps and singing. They have a great time, and before he realizes that 24 hours have passed and St. Peter returns. Well then, he says, you spend a day in hell and a day in heaven. You must now choose your eternity. The senator reflects for a minute, then answers. Well, I would have never said it before. I mean, heaven is delightful, but I think I would be better off in hell. So St. Peter escorts him to the elevator and he goes down, down, down to hell. The door opens and he finds himself in the middle of a barren land, covered with waste and garbage. He sees all of his old friends dressed in rags, picking up the trash and putting it in black bags as more trash falls from above. The devil comes over and pushes his arm around his shoulder. I don't understand, stammers the senator. Yesterday I was here and there was a golf course in a clubhouse where we ate lobster and caviar. We drank champagne and danced and had a great time. Now there's a wasteland full of garbage and my friends look miserable. What happened? The devil smiles at him and says, yesterday we are campaigning. Today we voted. Vote wisely on November 2nd, 2010. Vote wisely on November 2nd, 2010. Vote wisely November 2nd, 2010. Okay. Vote wisely on November 2nd, 2010. 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 Vote wisely on November 2nd, 2010.